So today we're going to talk about um, online patching in this video. Uh, um, there is a patch for this particular database. Um, it's called 1701824. Um, my database name is uh, OCM. Show that. And I've already done some prerequisites. Uh, the O patch version has to be updated, which I did already. And I also had to apply the 11.203.12 um, patch, or maybe 11.203.13 patch as a prerequisite before I did this online patch. So let's check that out. see that there was a patch was applied and this was the 1120313 patch actually. So this was a prerequisite for this patch that I'm about to apply which is called 1701824 and I'll show you what that is. And it is 170. So this patch is an online patch and how can I tell? Well we can use O patch to, to tell us that. So it, it generates a, a, some verbose output here, but there is a place where it says patch is an online patch true. So we're going to apply this patch online, and I'm going to show you how to do that. Okay, so we're going to go. Syntax here is Sydney. Okay, O patch succeeded. Now, let's do some verification here to make sure that um, the O patch, the patch was actually applied. So we're going to go to the patch, patch, inventory, dash details. So let's just see if this patch was applied and where this patch was applied. Wow, lots of detail here. What I'll do here is let's do this again. And I'll send it to some output. Here it is, and uh, we can tell that it's an online patch. Um, it says an interim patch. That might be a, an indication, but also the online patches are put into this H patch subdirectory. Um, let's take a we can take a look at that just for fun. So it's in the Oracle Home H patch subdirectory. Let's go ahead and do that. See, now we have this um, 
stuff that goes in here once we apply that patch online. Uh, but one of the key things you can do to see if the patch is actually applied is let's grep for in the alert log. So let's go there. And Sure enough, the online patch has been applied, and we can also do this a different way. We can go here and we say Aura debug patch list, and sure enough, this is the patch that's been applied, and that's it for this uh, particular video.